I discovered the valley of the shifting, whispering sands while prospecting for gold in one of our western states. I saw the silent windmills, the crumbling water tanks, the bones of cattle and burrows picked clean by buzzards, bleached by the desert suns. I stumbled over a crumbling buckboard nearly covered by the sand, and stopping to rest, I heard a tinkling, whispering sound, and suddenly realized that even though the wind was quiet, the sand did not lie still. I seemed to be surrounded by a mystery so heavy and oppressive, I could scarcely breathe. For days and weeks, I wandered aimlessly in this valley, seeking answers to the many questions that raced through my fevered mind. Where was everyone? Why the white bones, the dry wells, the barren valley where people must have lived and died? Finally, I could go no farther. My food and water gone, I sat down and buried my face in my hands. And resting thus, I learned the secret of the shifting, whispering sands. How I managed to escape from the valley, I do not know. But now, to pay my final debt for being spared, I must tell you what I learned out on the desert so many years ago. It always whispers to me of the days of long ago when the settlers and the miners fought the crafty Navajo. How the cattle roamed the valley. Happy people worked the land. And now Everything is covered by the shifting, whispering sands. How the miner left his buckboard, went to work his claims that day. And the burrows broke their halters when they thought he'd gone to stay. Wandered far in search of water, Onto old sidewinders' well, and there, their bones picked clean by buzzards that were circling when they fell. How they found the aged miner lying dead upon the sand. After months, they could but wonder. This is what they wish. 
Through this fog.